This one's called No More Hiding Places, right? <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's always known that the rules are not the same. Every seed you've ever sown gave you immunity from blame. Have you ever wondered why we've turned a blind eye? Did you assume we wouldn't mind? You'd find some place You'd find some place to hide One, two, three, four Come and ray or not One, two, three, four Turns the thieves, and I hope you've slept well recently, cause you won't do any more. And the will of the people come back, come back on your door. said a really good thing, um, which I was deeply flattered by, but I thought was quite insightful. He said the song that I'd written, the music to go with that, felt like it, it needed to be told. 
it needed to be said sort of straight away and 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 not too considered, not thought about, not massaged and manicured into a song. Song, it just felt like it, it needed it felt, to be. Yeah, it just felt like. I need to communicate this to you. Yeah, that's right. I think you were more eloquent than me. You said, I need to communicate to you, this to you now. And, you know, there's, there's two pretty dense sheets of, of A4 with lyrics on here. And, and I sort of read them and started picking out the phrases I wanted to use in some, some words that read well and speak well, but don't sing well. And that's some things that people who think music is poetry put to music it's not, it's where it goes wrong. There's a, there's a bloody compromise that takes place as, as the lyrics fight it out with melody to, to see what shapes fit. Um, but it's easy to, to smooth it over. Sometimes you make things too smooth and you need grit. So, so leaving immunity in, leaving, it's quite, I, don't, I, don't, I haven't heard too many songs with immunity, but that's got an immediate sense of rhythm. So you put that in, you, you keep that, that informed the song. Um, Another thing was just cutting out whole chunks, things that, well, that, that they're, not, they're not bad, they don't, they don't do bad things. Arguably, I left out the best line in the whole song, which was, um, there's a halogen beam and it burns through the mask, and, it, and armed with the questions no one dared to ask. It's a great line, but, but it sort of splits the message, and, and, and would, I felt that you'd said sort of pretty much everything in these first two bits. It was really direct, really hard, really sort of honest. And then it was just a case of shaping one or two things to fit and, and seeing if the sentiment of your words was matched by the sentiment of the music, which is quite, feels, feels sort of like a bit of a march and a bit of a yeah. chant. And then, and then this last bit, this, I just don't know if you can see that that's how that's written out. It's just, you know, almost stream of consciousness. And, and, and that's why I didn't worry too much about getting it spoiled as I was reading it. But it's... Um, I think that's quite an, an interesting thing in songs as well, is to not try and mould certain parts of your lyric and thought sort of process, because because that's that's really immediate, that's really honest, that's just you being really angry. You're not even necessarily coherent. That's just like just coming out, and and because you haven't fussed with it, I just thought that was that just really felt a sort of good indicator of, of rage and I think I think just you know in the time that you had putting something like that together for you who wasn't sure whether your lyrics were just words or whether they were songs yeah. that's lyrics that's a song yeah yeah mm -hmm. brilliant Steve well done. Yeah.